today we're going to be solving a probability question. We have three workers in an office and they take turns bringing breakfast for each other on Fridays. This Friday's theme is bagel grab bag. Miss Blackwell has put a sesame bagel, a whole wheat bagel, and an onion bagel in one bag. Okay, and then in another bag she's put two servings of plain cream cheese and two servings of veggie cream cheese. Each worker will randomly grab a bagel out of one bag and then they will go to another bag and they will grab a serving of cream cheese. And the question is what is the probability that Ms. Blackwell will grab a whole wheat bagel and a plain cream cheese if she's the first one to pick from both bags? In order to answer any probability question, we're going to have to know how many outcomes are possible. And the one way we can do that is by making a probability tree. Because there are two bags that Ms. Black will be choosing from, we have two things that we're going to be doing. We're going to be picking from the first bag. And in that first bag, there's a sesame bagel, a whole wheat bagel, and an onion bagel. And then in the second bag, there's uh, two plain cream cheeses and there are two veggie cream cheeses. We are trying to find what is the probability that Ms. Blackwell chooses a whole wheat bagel and that she also chooses a plain cream cheese. So once we find the probability of each event, we can uh, multiply our two probabilities to find out what is the probability of both of those things happening. So first off, in going into the first bag, there are three things that could happen. Since there's one of each bagel, you have a one and three chance of picking a sesame bagel, a one and three chance of picking a whole wheat bagel, and a one and three chance of picking an onion bagel. So the probability of Ms. Blackwell choosing a whole wheat bagel is one out of three. Once you move on to the second event, which is picking from the second bag, it would say that there were two plain cream cheeses and there were two veggie cream cheeses. So the chances of Ms. Blackwell choosing a plain cream cheese will always be two out of four because there are two plain cream cheeses in the bag, but there are four total cream cheeses. And the probability of her picking a veggie is also two out of four. Had she chosen a whole wheat bagel, she still has a two in four chance of choosing a plain cream cheese and a two in four chance of choosing a veggie cream cheese. And had Ms. Uh, Blackwell chosen an onion bagel, she would still have a two out of four chance of choosing a plain cream cheese and a two out of four chance of choosing a veggie cream cheese. The question was, what was the probability of her choosing a whole wheat, which we know was one third, and at the same time choosing a plain cream cheese, which has always been two out of four. The event that we are looking for will be this branch here, the whole wheat and the plain cream cheese. In order to find uh, the probability of both events happening, you would just need to multiply the probability of the first event, which is whole wheat, times the probability of the second event, which is plain cream cheese, which means you have a 2 out of 12 chance of getting a whole wheat bagel with cream cheese, which does reduce to 1 out of 6. So um, I don't think this is going to happen for uh, Ms. Blackwell, but uh, she's got a 1 in 6 chance. Maybe she likes her chances. 